This video will show you how students can use class codes in the Khan Academy Kids app to sign in easily. Students can use class codes to sign in anywhere, whether they're using Khan Kids in the classroom with you or whether they're learning at home. If they're learning at home, you can send your class code to parents so that they can help their child sign in. First, I'll show you how to find your class code and share it directly from the Khan Kids app. At the top left, tap Teacher Settings next to the Teacher Avatar. This is your Teacher Settings page, and your class code is located here toward the top of the screen. You can use the drop-down menu next to the code to copy it to your clipboard or to generate a new class code at any time. You can also share your class code directly from the app by tapping here. You'll notice that you have both a text code and a scan code below it. You have three options of sharing your class code. First, you can choose to print out your class code to post in your classroom so that students can scan it, or you might choose to print it if you're sending home physical copies of the code to parents. Alternatively, you can save to camera roll this is really helpful if you're sending a message to parents via text or via a classroom communication app. And lastly, you can choose to email the code as a PDF. This option will automatically generate an email from you that will include your class code and instructions for how to use it. If you change your password or generate a new class code, make sure you distribute the new class code to students and their parents. Now, let's say that I'm a student or parent that received a class code from you, and now I'm using it to sign in. Please remember that it's important that students and parents use your class code to sign into Con Kids. Otherwise, they won't receive your assignments and you won't be able to monitor their student progress. First, make sure that the free Con Kids app is downloaded on the student's mobile device from the App Store. When I, as a student, open the app, I'll see this screen. At the top right, I'll tap sign in with class code. The app will ask whether I want to type it or scan it. Today, I'll select type code. So I'll go ahead and type it and tap enter. Now you'll see this screen that asks who will be using this device. If I'm a teacher using shared device in my classroom, I'll go ahead and pick the whole class. It will set the screen like this so that when students open the app, they'll need to pick their name from the whole class view. Now, if I'm a teacher with one-to-one -one devices in the classroom, or if I'm a parent using the app at home, I'll pick the specific student name who will be using the device. This will set the screen so that the student only sees their name and avatar when they open the app. And that's it, the student will be signed in. On the student homepage, students can tap the library button in the top left. And this is where they'll see assignments from you, their teacher.